In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to make a voice recognition robot. You first need two wheels. I just took a servo horn, screwed it into the center here. You can use any wheel you want. You also want a sheet of plastic. I cut this one out, drilled a hole in each corner, put screws in, and attached two servos using a connector right here. I also put Velcro on both ends, I'll explain that later. You need a on-off switch. In this particular case it comes with the Axon 2 microcontroller. You'll need a VR bot voice recognition module, one 6 volt battery, also you'll need a twist tie and some rubber bands. Now getting started you want to first attach your wheels to the servos so it just snip goes right into the servo horn, both ends. So you want to screw that in. Next you want to attach your battery. This battery I've already put Velcro on the back here so I could easily just put it on like this. Now I have it off center. The mass is off center for a reason and you'll see why later. You also have the on off switch so you want to attach the on off switch to the battery like so. Flip it around. Now, for the VR bot module, I also put Velcro here so that it'll easily connect right there. So that module is connected. Now, to wire it, do it like this. So the white wire goes on the far left and the blue wire in the middle, like that. Now the other wire that comes with it, the black wire goes on the outside that's ground, while the red goes in the middle, like that. Then we want to mount the axon. There are many ways you could do it. You could either Velcro it on, or you could use the screw mounts, like so. Today I'm going to do it really fast, because we don't have time. So I just sit it there. Now we connect the module. So the black and red go to the regulated line on the axon too. So the red line's in the center and the black is on the outside. We then want to connect the UART. So the white is the transmit. So it goes to the receive on the axon too. And we're going to connect it to UART 2, like so. Now we want to connect the servos. So the left wheel, we are going to connect it to B5, like that. And the right servo will connect to B7. Voltage, the battery, we will connect to battery. Simple. Now gather up your wires a little. Now to hold the axon on, we're going to use rubber bands today because I'm lazy. I just want to make this quick for the tutorial, but you should use a proper mounting method. Here's rubber band. Rubber band. So now the axon is uh, firmly on there. Now you want to gather up your wires. Notice the microphone here. You want to make sure that the mi microphone stays up. And finally, a twist tie. So 
So twist and tie all your wires on there. Now I've already programmed the Axon to run voice recognition software and you can find that on my website. So you just flip it on and it should run automatically. To test it, there's a status LED. Can't really see it here, but if I say LED, it'll turn off and then back on, which means it's working. So, left, left, right, right, forward, left, forward. left, forward. It also understands the Thai language. So that command it to speak Thai, I just say, Pasa Thai. And then I could send it any other command, such as, Leo Sai, Drong Bai, Leo Kwa Leo Kwa Drong Bai Leo Sai Drong Bai Leo Sai Leo Sai Leo Sai Leo Kwa Leo Kwa. Now to swap back to English, I just say Pesa Angret. And then I issue a command such as forward, right, forward. And that concludes my tutorial.